Good evening. Police have described thefts of donated goods outside a charity shop in Camborne, Camborne as deplorable. Donna Pill, who runs a cat charity rescue centre, says the spate of thefts is threatening their future. She's published CCTV images of the incidents in the hope of tracking down those responsible. Richard Lawrence reports. This is the footage Donna Pill has posted online of the brazen thieves helping themselves to goods left to raise the vital money to help fund the vet's bills and the food of the cats she has in care for rehoming or looking after. At the end of the day, I'm only a small rescue. I've got the same amount of food, litter bills, um, neutering vet's bills, etc. And I just can't afford the loss. I need whatever donations I can get coming in through the shop, especially when we suffered a really harsh winter this year. The first clip shows a woman picking up the bags on the 11th of February at 20 past eight in the evening before making off in her car. Donna has made it perfectly clear how she feels about the crime in her shop window. <laughs> totally shocked, to be fair. Um, I mean, I'm this I do for the community. They probably think, oh, well, they're unwanted goods to begin with. But they're not. They're actually brought here, put in my doorway because of the thousands of cats that I have rehomed over the years. People do know me, um, especially those that I've helped out over the years. And they're the ones that bring me their donations because they know that I am self-funded through the shop. Um, many have been to my house through a rehome, etc. They know how hard the job is and it's taken food out of their mouths. The second incident on the 22nd of February, just after half past eight, shows what could be a different woman. The police say they're appalled by the incidents. First of all, I'd like to say that Donna's work with her charity is admirable. And it's a shame that there aren't more people like that. As far as the theft is concer concerned, I think it's absolutely deplorable for somebody to steal items that a member of the public has dropped off to a charity for such a good cause is disgraceful. While the police want to hear from anyone who may recognise the two women, Donna is naturally appealing to those donating goods to do so during opening hours in the hope of stopping any repeat of the incidents. Richard Lawrence, ITV News, Camborne. On to sport and in rugby, 